Hey, greetings everyone. It's August 26, 2010. Um, I've been back in Nashville for two days after spending 12 days in Kentucky shooting my movie The Lashman. Everything turned out really well. We came in under budget and on time. Really about three and a half hours over schedule, but for the most part did really well with just getting everything shot. I've got a couple more scenes left to do over the course of the next couple months. Uh, just things that don't involve the initial cast that was up with me the entire time. But for the most part, we got, you know, everything shot. Real happy with the way things turned out. Um, we started on Friday the 13th, which was always a good way to kick off a horror movie. And we actually ended on my birthday, um, which was my 29th birthday. Kind of surreal whenever, we, you know, we finally rolled out all the tape that we had to roll out, came back in, and the cast had a birthday cake for me. Uh, probably the best birthday I've had in a very, very long time. It's just good to accomplish something of that magnitude. I'm real proud of myself. I'm real proud of everyone who worked on this. And just um, just for being able to get through it, it was hot. You know, it was just tough to deal with. I blew out two pairs of sneakers, like blew the heels right off of them. Um, just walking on, you know, rocky mountainsides and things like that. I think, you know, people are going to dig it. It's going to take a couple months. There's no big rush to get it out. We're trying to do everything right and get everything, you know, nailed down the way that it should be nailed down as opposed to just trying to rush some you know, crappy movie out to make a buck. So anyways, again, really happy with it. Um, got more to say about this, but it's kind of weird. I need a couple of, you know, days or weeks to kind of step back and look at it. Uh, there was a whole lot of video footage that was recorded that I'll be trying to put up sporadically. No, I'm not in a lot of it because I was so busy, I just didn't have time to do a lot of that. But a lot of the cast and crew had flip cameras the entire time and were doing just behind the scenes vlogs and stuff like that. So I think there's going to be some cool stuff. I tried not to watch any of that while I was up there, so I haven't seen a lot of it. Um, just trying to keep a fresh perspective from their point of view. I thought it would be fun to you know, watch that as it came down the pipeline. So I've got seriously um, a couple hundred videos that are anywhere from, you know, 20 seconds up to, you know, five or 10 minutes that I'm going to be you know kind of watching here and there some of it will save for dvd i'm sure some of it will put up as as need be um trying to figure out the best way to promote this thing and just kind of get the information out there so if you got any ideas for me let me know um otherwise pretty good year like say c coming up on a birthday the way that it did it's you know probably the toughest thing that i've ever had to do to shoot this movie i mean just mentally and physically and everything else i'm beat down i just want to sleep i've every piece of time off i've had since i've got home I've been sleeping, and I'm planning on doing that again fairly quickly. But uh, I sound—I feel like I sound tired, and I'm sure that you, some of you have probably picked up on that. Um, I don't know. My whole body just hurts from, let's say, going up and down the hills of you know the Kentucky hillsides and things like that. But never had a m more fun time in my life. I'm just really, really glad that I was able to do that and just kind of get it all in on time. So, anyways, I uh, hope you look forward to seeing it. As the months go by, I'll tell you more about it as merited. Um, but until next time, catch you later. Bye.